Glasgow Mummy here. I'm just back from an event at Malmaison this afternoon where I was speaking with the reps from Bubble and Bumble, O John and Smashbox. Um, so there'll be more on this soon on the blog and I'm looking forward to trying out some of the products. Um, you can see that my hair does need a little bit of help. Um, and after that I went to Whole Foods and I've been trying to be good and I've got my PT in the morning. I'm supposed to be kind of sticking to a healthy diet which has not been working so much when there's so many treats at my work. Um, so I went to go and get myself some things that I would consider as healthy treats that hopefully will be okay for me to eat. Um, I'm just watching Rhubarb who's jumped up and I'm waiting for him to pounce on me. Um, so I'm going to flip the camera and show you what I picked up uh, today at Whole Foods. Here's Crumble having his dinner. Crumble! Good barbies behind me. Hello. They're getting so much bigger now. Hello, sweetie. Hello. Anyway, back on to what I got at Hopkins. So, um, we're going to have a steak stir fry tonight, and this um, beef stir fry was in the sale. Let me turn it around so you can see. So, I picked up some of this and a sweet and sour stir fry sauce. I think we'll go and focus. So that's for dinner for tonight. Um, I also couldn't resist the sushi, so I picked up some brown rice tuna and salmon roll combo, um, which I will probably also have for my dinner. Maybe not so healthy if I'm eating so much stuff. Anyway, um, some of the other things I got, um, I picked up this Root Health Almond Milk, um, which I'm going to try and use instead of regular milk. Um, I'm hoping that if I limit my dairy, it will help with my Crohn's. Um, and I've also picked up some almond butter to try, because I've seen quite a few YouTubers using almond butter. Um, so I'm going to give that a go and I got some crackers. So I've got some whole grain spelt crackers from the food doctor and I got some Root Health oat and spelt thins that I will try as well. Um, I also got some seeds. So I've got these munchy seeds, chili bites. I've had these before, they're quite good it's just for sticking on top of a salad or having a handful if you're hungry. Um, and I got these, these are broad beans, fried and salted. So these probably aren't as healthy, but I'm sure it must be better than eating loads of crisps. And as long as I just have a small amount of them. And this time a roasted bean mix the food doctor. And these are actually quite nice. And I would happily have a handful of these instead of a packet of crisps. Um, and I'm sure it's better for you than crisps would be. Um, I picked up some fruit, all the food at Whole Foods just looks amazing. I picked up some pineapple um, and I'll have that with my lunch tomorrow. Um, now that we're getting into winter I love hot juice and this is one of my favourites so spiced winter berries cordial and I make it up like a hot you would a hot ribena. I always like their cordials they're really good. Um, I picked up some oat cakes. So these purser oat cakes are really good. They're nice, thick and chunky. Um, and this is the cat black pepper ones. Um, oh, and I picked up some tea. So I'm gonna try and stop drinking so much tea because of the dairy. Um, so I picked myself up an apple and ginger tea. Focus here. Anyway, apple and ginger tea by Dr. Stewart. Crumble has joined us. Get down. Um, and I bought a couple of other things just to try. I've not had these before. So the Primal Kitchen Brazil Nut and Cherry Paleo Bar. And I got some licorice as well. Yum. And the last thing I got was this was in the sale and um, 
it's for just something funny for R. So it says jump up and kiss me and it's a hot sauce. <laughs> I thought it was funny. Um, anyway, so that's everything that I bought and um, the total of all of that was £40. Um, which I think is reasonable for Whole Foods. It is your kind of more expensive place to shop. Um, anyway, I'm gonna go and get cooking this stir fry. Okay, talk to you later. Thanks for watching.